Day two. <clears throat> Reached an old lighthouse. Guard Skaggy. I think it's just, and there's a ship here too. I'm gonna go read what this is. I'm gonna put my wind jacket on, it's pretty chilly. Oh, it's not in English. This guy was the captain of this ship. I'm not sure what happened, but uh, the GK20 Holmstein. Yeah, I think I'm gonna put on my rain wind jacket. It's nine degrees Celsius. So nine fifths times nine is 81 fifths, 16.2 plus 32. It's 48.2 degrees out in Fahrenheit, but it's windy. There's no sun. Uh. to be in decent shape I mean I could climb up and in I suppose I don't need to though I'm gonna drive around to that red stripe lighthouse too I'm not sure if that's any different but by the way my friend uh, got bumped from his flight so he's gonna be another day late or er, a day late now so I'm on my own today for Gulf Falls, thing to Lear, the volcano. <laughs> Some other waterfall too. But uh, I'll check in at the next. I'm gonna hit a bunch of little things before the volcano. Ah, so that lighthouse is the tallest in Iceland. It was built in 1944. And now I'm uh, going to check out this one. is fairly calm you can see you can walk out it's uh well i mean i'm not gonna walk out but the water's not very deep i guess is what i'm getting at straight out man this is the good old north atlantic 1897 i wonder if it's open no Bunch of birds out there on the rocks, like a lot. Put on my jacket and my hat. Probably gonna put on pants too. It's chilly. So anyway, two lighthouses. I forgot what the next stop is. So this is the bridge between the two continents. I am on the Eurasian plate right now and this is <clears throat> literally the gap between two continental plates right here <clears throat> and uh, I don't know why there are these locks everywhere but you can see on the other side here is the North American plate so I'm back in North America yeah Our sixth largest continental tectonic plate. Eastern Florida has the Appalachian Mountains, obviously, and the big mountains where the Pacific Plate <coughs> hits the North American Plate. I still call it Mount McKinley here. Here are all the plates. The North American plate's pretty big, I guess. Oh, there's a, I didn't know about the Cocos plate, or the Nazca plate for that matter. There's a lot of little plates. But uh, Pacific plate, North American plate, Eurasian plate are the big boys. But uh, 
pretty cool. Oh, if there was one car in the parking lot, now all of a sudden there are five. Well, I'm one of them, but so three more people just, three more cars just showed up. I'm starting to trend. So yeah, here it is. I forget what the next stop is, something little. Oh, the beach, Stora Sandvik Beach, I'm gonna check out next. Ah, so here's another lighthouse here. Ah, I'm not gonna walk or, I don't think you could drive up. I'm not gonna walk up to it. There's some other little rock sort of things you could walk out on out here, look over the coast. Um, I'm not necessarily gonna do that either. But just wanted to show you where we were. Just a quick little stop, five minutes off the road. See another lighthouse, the Vonal, let's see what it was. Uh, Valan Nukamol. I'm not sure if that's the name of the lighthouse. That's where we were going though, so. Next stop is going to be the Brimketel Lava Rock and then a shipwreck. We are at uh, the Brimketel Lava Rock. There's this nice little path. <clears throat> Very, well, sort of corroded sort of these pools of water here in the lava rock. Oh, there's a cool pool. Look, there's a little bench too. <clears throat> Not really too much to see here. It's a cool pool though. But this is uh, definitely uh, volcanic black igneous rock. Um, sort of all these pools, inlets, so we are headed to a shipwreck and then we will be doing an actual hike uh, to the volcano. <clears throat> so we're here at this shipwreck. 1988. All 11 sailors got rescued. It's pretty messed up. south end of the Wreck Janes Peninsula, just in the middle of all this rock, went on a dirt road. Um, but we're on the way uh, to this volcano next. So this is actually a hike, probably, I think it's like a six mile hike or something. So the volcano I don't think is currently erupting with like red lava, so it won't be as cool as what I've seen in the videos from the past couple years, but still, that's what we're doing next. 